put it on the final touches. What is this, wax? Mm -hmm. You guys remember the cabinet used to be brown? Now it's, uh, I don't know what you want to call it, marine wash? And now you're applying the wax. Table, second table project. And like usual, I'm doing nothing, right? Right? <laughs> I got a direct. So, this is the center table that she's making that uh, frame that she got ordered. We took the glass out so she could paint it white. And then, I guess we'll see what happens. guys are wondering why I'm doing lines is because this is the frame that I we got custom made that comes with no lines you see and then our table has lines so actually I'm doing the lines right there and hopefully it matches oops sorry so let me stop yapping because I always complain I yap too much and don't work table and now we're actually doing the final decorations oh actually I didn't record the final uh, of the table if you guys remember we're talking about the frame that she actually made and there it is uh, I wasn't here when she actually put the decorations inside on the sand but that's the table there so that was uh, now we're just doing the final touches putting a little rope around the edge of the table to cover the where the two where the frame meets the actual table oh and remember the table used to be brown we sanded it and now it's like a wash wood and oh let me show you guys the what do you call it the night the what do you call it the tv stand that we we're working on it there you go she made a seahorse and that's the wash there Came out pretty good. Oh, her sister made that lighthouse. And a little rope that I put. So now that's why we're putting this rope on there to match it. So, what do you guys think? Creativity, right? Creativity. So, hopefully, little by little, it's getting there. Today we also, I think we're gonna put the curtains. Alright, we're putting the curtains. Really? Really hoping? Let me go back to work because I always saying I talk too much and I don't work.
Okay, so the final product is done. And the good thing is that you can always lift this glass up and then replace the decoration inside. So if you ever get bored of it, it's pretty cool, right? So check out the little rope we did. That was the little rope we did there. So famous decorator. The who? Well, it's time to put the curtains up. All right. Here we go. Oh, forgot about this right here. Another. Uh... That's not finished. Don't show that yet. Oh, it's not finished? My bad. Okay. Forget that you guys saw that. Oh, you guys remember I was working on this little corner here? There. Oh, the decorations up here. I forgot. She got this pelican. Custom made. She actually did it with... She did it with a spoon and a fork. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Too much creativity. Oh, look at this. That's actual seaweed that we took from the sandbar. Too much. Too much creativity, man. And I washed them with Mistolini. You're born and raised from the islands, you gotta have that tropical feel at the house. So, let's keep going. what exactly what are we doing I bought some floor laminate right there uh, this color oops not that color okay let me take it out of the box you see the floor laminate that looks like wood right and it comes with glue on the back and I just started if you guys notice there I put my first piece and then I'm using right there if you can see it brad nails with a stapler to keep it in place and then you see we're gonna go ahead and line it up all up and down the wall, all the way up, and then it's gonna all the way there, and it's gonna look like the wall is made out of wood. So let's go, cause it's gonna be a long journey. What you say? The ladder. To Just to do the decoration. You guys can notice it. The old 
wash wood 